Hello my amazing sexy mofos, this is your boy Venomy here, I really do hope you're all okay and having an amazing day so far. In today's video, I'm just going to be showing every single one of you how you can save the bunker caddy as a personal vehicle. But straight off the bat, if you're new around here and like what you see, then please do subscribe to join this amazing sexy family. But now let's jump straight into this. Credit to Brune Tango for discovering this, honestly his channel link will be in the description below, he has some awesome content, definitely go check him out. But when it comes to this video, I just want to say really quickly, this is only to store the second caddy, if you're looking to store the first one then I am really really sorry, this is only for the second one with the tarp and the gasoline, the jerry can on the back. But to start off, you just want to go into the back of your MOC and make sure that you do have a free LG in the back because that vehicle in the back of your MOC is going to be replaced by the caddy that you want to store. All you need to do is go into the back of your MOC, get into your free LG and simply drive it out the back of your MOC. After this, you just want to drive right to the back, like right behind your MOC. It will say right on your D-pad to enter your MOC. From here, open up your phone, go to Maze Bank Foreclosure. You want to find your bunker, go to Renovate. Then you want to go to Shooting Range for the cheapest option. Change your shooting range from white to black. And from here, you simply want to hover over buy and then quickly press A and Y and then the second your screen goes black you want to hit right on your d-pad four times. You should be on foot and unable to pause your game. You physically will not be able to pause the game to go to the online tab. Simply invite a friend inside your bunker, it can even be a random person, just simply spam the whole lobby, you just need one player to come inside your bunker, and now the second you get on whatever caddy you want to store, it will teleport you doing the cutscene of you driving the caddy inside the back of the MOC. Now you might be on this little cutscene, this animation for a little bit, do not worry. You are going to drive inside the back of the MOC and that is going to be saved and stored. Now there is one thing really quickly, you can't actually physically drive it out the back of your MOC. Which isn't too bad, I'm just going to show you what happens now. But if you do, you just, you'll just be on foot, that's the only thing. The only way you can actually drive it out in the world of GTA is either by requesting it via the interaction menu over your MOC or you could call your mechanic and have it delivered that way. It's entirely up to you how you go about it. It's just a funny rare vehicle to have I guess, just to have fun with your mates. But I really do hope you're all okay and having an amazing day so far. We're on the road to 9k, so I want to thank you all for the love and support. Remember, subscribe if you are new. Like the video to show your love and support if you have enjoyed it, of course. But I'm going to wrap this video up here. I love every single one of you, and I hope you're all okay. I know I said that already, but I'll see you all in the next video.